Exclusive, a teenager staring down the barrel of a gun on his birthday. And tonight, the family needs your help to catch this robber on the run. Local 10's Terrell Fournay is working this story from Palmetto Bay Park. He has the exclusive. Terrell. Well, this crime happened in broad daylight, right in the middle of Palmetto Bay Park. And the family at the center of this ordeal, they now believe that there's actually been a trail of trouble here. Palmetto Bay Park is known for its athletic courts and well-kept trails, but for the Williams family, it will forever be known as something else. A gun being pulled on a 15-year-old two minutes from his house with a park filled with people is unacceptable. The crime happened Saturday afternoon when Michelle's son was riding his bicycle with a friend through the park just as the unassuming thieves approached. He's like, give me your phone, reached down, opened his backpack, showed him a gun. My son sat back. He was like, you know, here, take it. They snatched two iPhones from the boys and the teen's bike, similar to this one. It was his birthday and his birthday present. The teen is still too rattled to appear on camera. His mom says that thief even responded to messages sent to the stolen phone, hoping to dupe unsuspecting texters into sending cash through a mobile app. It's say yes. What's your cash app name? Maybe they're clueless enough to, and sure enough, they sent the cash app name. So now the police have that. And now Michelle is armed with troubling info about the park's history. Here's one. Um, it says they stole my son's phone on the basketball court, too. Then here's another one. Both of their bags were stolen. And yet there is a glimmer of good news. So this is a gift from my coworker. The birthday boy's bike has already been replaced. The same night. I'm just so blessed and grateful. So that's what I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think about that. And this family says that they just want the people behind this incident to be arrested. They want justice served and they want the community to be aware. They also are telling us that uh, that they've been, been in touch with the mayor and the mayor of Palmetto Bay. She is now promising to step up police patrols here at this park. We are live in Palmetto Bay. I'm Terrell Fournay, Local 10 News.